Coal Strip, a power plant merger, is moving forward. Washington state utility regulators say they've reached a settlement in the proposed merger that could speed up the closure of Coal Strip Units 3 and 4. That takeover settlement includes $3 million for the community of Coal Strip, but it also means the town could lose its last two coal-fired plants sooner than expected. The $5.3 billion merger between Hydro One and current co-owner Avista could speed up the closure of Coal Strip units three and four by eight years. That's because Hydro One would pay off eight years of outstanding debt, moving the depreciation schedule for the units to 2027 instead of 2035. It also includes a promise from Avista to commit three million dollars to the Coal Strip community to soften the economic blow. The merger still requires approval from federal federal regulators as well as utility commissions in Washington, Idaho, Oregon, Montana, and Alaska. Coal Strip's older units one and two are already scheduled to shut down by 2022.